Welcome to the Vermont Concerned Citizen channel. We are a patriotic American community, and please consider supporting us on Patreon. Thank you. Come down with your breeches of deer skin and jackets of brown, with your red woolen caps and your moccasins. Come to the gathering summons of trumpet and drum. Come down with your rifle. And yeah, I'm collecting some old uh, military uniforms. Figured, what the hell? Things are getting harder and harder to find. So, anyways, we got the pants, we got the jacket or blouse. Got the boonie cap. You seen that video? Now we got a patrol cap. Not really impressed with a patrol cap. It's a hot weather one. And of course, the manufacturer or the retailer online didn't tell me who it was going to be made by. It just said USGI specs. Well, proper is close to USGI specs, but it's no cigar. Look at the bill. Thought the bill looked short on this. Maybe it's just the color. I did compare it to originally USGI woodland. It's about the same length, same width, same height. However, this one, for my big fat noggin, is seven and a quarter, or seven and a half. It doesn't say seven and a half, all it says is large. This booty hat, seven and a half, fits perfect. Not too tight, not too loose. This is very snug. This is the problem with some of this aftermarket stuff. You just don't know the sizing. Maybe somebody sold it a little bit too tighter. Color seems off from the original. This definitely looks close to the original. That was from the same fabric lot. This is probably some from the same fabric lot as this one. Maybe a little bit darker. The brown doesn't show the two browns. Well, I guess it does, but they're definitely off. But uh, It'll be close enough just for the collection until I can find a real one. So, how much I can show you on a patrol hat? This one's not insulated. This one is hot weather. Short little bill. Front rear rank would go up there. I don't know if they still do it, but you just put your name tape in the back. And uh, that's about it, folks. Little uh, proper BDU patrol cap, fatigue cap. Only paid about ten bucks for it. Am I happy with it? Not really, but it goes with the collection, I guess. Hope that helps, guys. See you later. Yeah, I got those in the wash. Like I said, it was patrol cap, size large, proper legacy of service. I don't know if they ever really made anything for the military. If you know they did, then let me know. But I don't think they were. I think it's just one of the copycats. I just pulled that out of the washing machine. That looks much better. At least now it's kind of standing up the shape the way they had it flattened out and rolled up in the package. So, everything's shooken out. Pull in dryer, load a little heat, tumble dry. Just kind of let them air dry in a low, low heat. You are your first and last line of defense. Keep that powder dry. Be safe. Stay armed. Please like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell notification for future videos.